it's time for a little brute force. So there's all sorts of strategies you can take when playing this game. You can use a shield, dagger, long, long sword, axes, but sometimes there's just something about a big hammer and just smacking your enemies around. So before we do that, let's go take a look at the gear. So the the critical the the important thing for for me at least in this build is of course the warhammer. I'm just using a uh, orcish warhammer. I've upgraded it a little, not too much, but I did enchant it with uh, puncturing the combat enchantment basically for this weapon. Physical damage ignores 337 points of target's block rating. So if you're going up against an enemy who likes to block a lot, well, it's not going to help. <laughs> Weapon is all right. It's cool looking. I like that. I like my character. He looks kind of cool. I also have orcish heavy armor with a health enchantment. Let's take a look at that real quick. Comes with the health. Cleaving and fire resistance. This build isn't about defense very much. Silver helmet of minor health. Gauntlets of absorption. Let's see what that one looks like. Restores health by damage done. Up to 2, 2, and 3 points for light, versatile, and heavy weapons respectively. So that should give me a little health. And orcish plate boot with the health enchantment so I generally go with the health enchantment because they are it's general right so I this isn't a specific bill uh, gear set where I'm going up against certain enemies this is uh, for any enemy I, I kind of come across skill wise this is my experimental setup where I'm just you know trying different stuff out I have absorb which uh, I basically it, I use it for healing. It negates up to 37 damage, converts 100% of it of into healing. So it's a small heal. I I can upgrade it to 43. As I'm I'm just messing around with this build, so I haven't committed to anything. I also use adrenaline dodge. Restores up to 97 health. And if I update this, it can be 114. So this is a, a big healing spell, which I'll cover in another video. So this is what I'm going to take into battle. Let's go smack some uh, enemies upside the head. All right. We're in the dungeon here. Got my hammer, my sweet looking hammer. All set up. I just got a dwarven one too out of a golden chest. So I'm gonna try that one out. It's his battle axe though, so it looks like we're facing a lot of shielded characters, which is great, because you know, this is kind of an anti-shield build. We're just gonna be smacking these is it whites? Rights? Whites around and these skeletons. And it's great, even when they block, I mean we still get a pr pretty good damage. against them and they just start melting because like that that was a solid block on their part but we uh due to the puncturing still laid a lot of damage on them and these were entry these are entry level enchantments too so i have i need to upgrade the enchantments i just got my uh tower to level three so hope I have to go check out what it what it offers as far as improved enchantments and see what we can do. I generally use this build for uh, you know just jobs and stuff or the abyss. It I just enjoy the feel of it really. I mean it it doesn't feel great when you get blocked, but knowing you are still doing a good amount of damage when you do it. I'm just about combat feel. It, it's still good. I mean, as I'm not 
<laughs> as commenters have pointed out, I'm not very good at this game, which is fine. If there's a list of things I want to be good at in life, games are not high on that list. But, you know, Hammer's Warhammer's relatively low difficulty. So I'll take that. And, you know, we just kind of crushed this this dungeon. I mean, these enemies are, are pretty weak in comparison to what we're using. I just find the uh, a sh a shield and sword versus shield and sword to be a little slow and frustrating. But again, that's probably due to my own skill. Because I, I don't time things right. I don't stun them correctly, which I'm working on. That's fine. So we're exploring this dungeon just to get all the the last bits of loot from it. And we did. Check out the Elder Scrolls Blade content. To upper left, upper right. Appreciate any support, feedback, good or bad. Uh, upvotes, shares, anything like that. So thank you very much for watching. Have yourself a great day.